Well, that was a goddamn fiasco. You go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Come on, a little further. Sims, get the gurney. Save my ass. Maybe you're one of us after all. No matter what happens, I never forget the people I own. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping the persons. No more half acid. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Directly into the brain? I'm not sure I can watch this. Damn. Through the eye socket. You sure about this, Doc? Wish there was another way. You got this, Bell. Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam, one more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? EKG is spiking. Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. You remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Do not trust Adler. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You ran forward and picked up an M16. Or maybe it was another one.
ADC fled into the tree line. It was then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker. The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. The zip line nearby was the best way back to the lake. We wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. Bell, turn back and use the zip line to reach the bunker. Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16. He stored up a hornet's nest. Need chopper support. ASAP. Roger that. Chopper inbound. ETA, two minutes. Coming to the window! Give me some cover! Push forward! Push forward!
Yes, this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. Christ, what's happening to him? I don't understand anything he's saying. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently. The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. The zip line nearby was the best way back. He wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. You equipped your shotgun and had a bow. That's when you discovered VC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents.
Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. Don't stop, Bell. Fuck, fuck! Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here you go. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged it. Path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. Stop fighting me, Bell, and go left. Turn around, Bell, and take the other path. a rope ladder leading to a bridge overhead. The bridge led toward the bunker, so you climbed the ladder. Bell, use the ladder to your left. Bell, the bunker isn't there. Turn back. Now. Why is she... Since she's married to such a team. A tunnel? You... Okay, you pulled out your sidearm and flashlight. Open it. A 
Lazar, give Bell another injection. Do it now! Those are some serious convulsions. Someone do something. Bell were completely off script. Maybe, Maybe Bell is just fried at this point. We pushed it too far. We have no leads. We've known each other for years. It appears the subject's program. Can Bell survive another round? You're asking me? Do it. We're not leaving empty handed. Script 17. Ready. Bell, we've got a job to do. We've been over this already. Skip ahead, next one. The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Bell, go into the bunker now. Bell, open the door. United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. You gotta admit I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation weren't working. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training's complete. We just need to give the subject a name. Bell.